How's it going everybody? It's Pride here and welcome back to another video. Today I wanted to revisit the Quakestone Hammer. It's been a while since I've used it, really since the first DLC came out. And I kind of want to use it because in a recent livestream, I think it was a couple weeks back, I did end up using this weapon and I really freaking enjoyed it. And I thought I might as well make another video on it and maybe start off a new series again for the old DLC weapons, kind of revisiting them and seeing how they hold up to the first time that I ever used them. I've gotten better at the game nope. and I feel like some of them have been improved and worsened. So definitely let me know if you guys would like to see that. I guess this could be like the start of it. Which one do you guys want to see next? Feel free to leave that in the comments section down below. But here's everything that I got. Got the hammer itself, shield, all the armor, all the rings. Getting 619 AR, it is fully strength, and at 140 I can basically have 40, 40, 40, 66. Pretty much the most ideal build possible for this weapon. So, 43 poise, not bad. I love this weapon the first time that I used it because I thought that it was a weapon that did have kind of a high risk thing, and that is the weapon art. And in case you guys don't know, a few patches ago they made that weapon art worse. They nerfed it to shit, absolute garbage. Like people were saying that it wasn't even worth using anymore. But then they did end up raising it again because they're like, okay, we kind of fucked this weapon up. And like you saw, it takes up a shit ton of stamina. So high damage is something that you're gonna want for this weapon. And I always thought that it was one that was fantastic for trading, especially with the bigger weapons because you could use the weapon art to trade with pretty much anything in the game almost always out trade with them especially if you end up hitting them and i kind of screwed up like i went all out with two. huh i did surprisingly low damage and that did some surprisingly high as fuck no okay he got that damage back that'd be good for me if he wants to do that actually yeah ah uh, just kidding oh still caught him never mind I thought I wasn't going to catch him at all, but I ended up catching him with the uh, second hit. Rolling attack! Yeah, I got extremely lucky there. Good game, Mr. Dragon Slayer. Fuck, that was too lucky. 80 HP. I have 80 left. That doesn't bode well for the future, but I usually get better, I think, as I play more matches. Nope. But like I was saying, man, this weapon art is one of my favorites in the game. I think that the damage is fantastic. You get ridiculous hyper armor. After the first one, you get perseverance. You can roll out after the first one. And the second hit can be delayed a ton. And then it'll send them flying. And has a surprisingly big hitbox radius. Very few negative things to say about this thing. It's kind of ugly, I guess. It's just a... Uh, uh, a slab of rock Artorius. on like a piece of metal or some shit like that. I don't really like the design of it, but what are you going to do? I definitely feel like the designs in, uh, in the second DLC were a lot better. Oh no, dude. Oh, he's sad. Stamina. And that's why you use a medium shield, people. Especially one like the You went too far there. You ever seen a flying Artorius? Are you... I guess I got him. Good game. Artorius. Oh, hey, I like your sweater. Fat dragon. Uh, I get, kinda, you're more, you're more of a demon with that helmet. Ha! Shit. That would've been nice to hit him twice. I thought he was gonna end up going for, uh... Ooh. Only hit me with the little dagger. I think I still had a little bit of perseverance left there. What? Excuse me? Gotcha, baby. Uh. <laughs> I hate this game, dude. What the fuck was that? That was so much more delayed than I ever could have expected. I thought that I didn't hit him. Did that hit him too? I don't know. Give me. Where's my cloth? Third. <gasps> it did actually hit him. I was joking too. Dude, I was fucking joking and it did hit him. See, I killed him, and it hasn't registered yet. All right, we're gonna get the victory here pretty soon. As you can see, he is dead on the floor. It, lo it might look like he's moving. That's just a death twitch, he is dead. All right, I won this match. Now he's dead. That might be some of the worst lag that I've ever seen. You think it was me in that match? Cause he looked a little weird. I don't think so, dude. Like I say every time, I feel like if I was that lackey, that much, 
I would have at least some lag every single game. I need to find out what part of China this guy's from. Please don't let it be the fat dragon again. Please don't let it be the fat dragon again. I'll take anyone. Give me another Artorias. I don't give a shit. I don't want it to be the fat dragon. It's the fat dragon, of course. Well, let's do this again. Did that hit him? Okay, good. Doesn't seem to be lagging anymore. I don't know what caused it in the first place then. Wait a minute! Oh, that wasn't gonna work. <laughs> I thought it was gonna come right back. Oh shit! Oh god, I have no stamina! He's still going! Man, that really, really was bad. I shouldn't have done any of that. I went too far. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if I did indeed hit him both of those times with the weapon art. And it just hasn't really kicked in yet. Come on, give me another hit. Oh, I thought I could delay that a little bit. Maybe catch him on wake up. Oh shit! Wait, what happened to my hit? It just disappeared? God damn it. Well, at least that- How is it that I won the insanely laggy match? But this one was not laggy and I got kind of destroyed. You know what it was? It was the one second weapon or hit. Took all my stamina, I couldn't roll away. He took about 900 HP, even with this armor and perseverance. He brought out all the stops there for all those dance moves. The spinner Rooney is really something. Someone else this time. Oh look, it's the best weapon from the second DLC. Just ridiculous. He might still have more hyper armor than me with his uh, weapon art. He does have a bunch of poise. Well, at least from the the chest piece, and he's got Havel Hand, as you can see. Oh, nice. Nice buff there. The cool one, the purple one. No hyper armor. Yeah. Good game. At least he didn't have more hyper armor than that. Or actually, I don't know. He was pretty early into the startup frames. Maybe they didn't even kick in. We'll assume that. Twin Ultra Great Swords. Ooh, that'll be nice to try out, actually, with my, uh, my weapon art. Oh no, if you're this laggy then I don't I don't know if I really want to. I would have expected him to keep going. Yeah, so had a I think a little bit of perseverance at the startup. <laughs> Just one little knife? That's fucked up, dude. <gasps> what? Okay. Well, I I don't know if that was lag or just the weapon's natural, ridiculous hitbox. I'm gonna assume that it was number two. Oh, if it isn't, that weapon again. But he's using it on one hand. Why? What do you have on your off? Oh, okay, never mind. He took out something else. There we are. Got him. Right in the same trap. Good game, Finn. I guess he had to use that. He was using the headpiece. I should really be using Smo's hammer. Or is it Ornstein's spear? Who is this guy again? I can't really remember, to be honest. I always forget. I can never remember whose helmet this is. But they're like minor characters, so I'm sure nobody in the comment section knows either. So, whatever. Who do we got? Mr. Purple. Shield and Greatsword, I think. Oh, Claymore. Dante. It's a cool name. That's actually a really cool name. That's one of the names. Is it weird that if I had a kid, I would want to name him something like Dante? Is that super edgy? I feel like that's an edgy name, but I think it's mainly because of Dante. Uh-oh. From uh, from the games. And that's why that name is considered to be so damn edgy. I was staring at you. I was fucking staring at him, dude. Trade! Perfect! And that is why you use heavy armor. If you can. Good game. 80? Oh, 100 this time. But yeah, Dante is one of the names, or something like, uh, Drimb, Drill, anything with a D, really. Diffly, Dooms, 
they just they or just the you know d u h e uh but that was before the d so d there's two of them again both of these are before the d or like philip or something all right this guy again and i do need to be careful because last time he backstabbed me and uh, we're probably gonna have something similar this time why do you keep doing that does he want to bait me into a uh a parry or something Okay, dude, you're gonna backstab fish all day? That's not nice. Ah, damn it. Fuck! That third hit? Yeah, it's not gonna hit him. I'm all out. I maybe shouldn't run with my back turned to him. He's gonna end up getting me with like one of those runaway backstabs. God damn it, dude. There we go, hyper armor right through that shit. Him and his fucking backstabs. Got a lot of that shit in this one. If he had something quicker, maybe it would've worked. Yeah, this guy's stuck in Dark Souls 1. What is that, Hollow Slayer? Uh, oh, Black Knight Sword, never mind. I think. Oh, it is. It's a lot of running. Come on, Ray J. Why don't you try to backstab me? The last guy had that covered. Jesus, this guy's running all over the place. I'll take it. Ah, that wasn't an even trade, I don't think. I did 388. I think he might have done about the same, actually. Hyper armor! That's where that comes in handy. Throw another one. Your knife missed. Alright. I think maybe if he gets a backstab, he might still kill me. Alright, he has health regen, definitely. That's just getting all oh, fucking returned to him. And if it keeps running, it'll be a lot tougher. Mm, I ain't gonna get trapped in that trap there. There we go. Fucking so much goddamn running now. I'm gonna run all over your corpse. You like that shit? You like me doing a marathon on your corpse? Now, this is the moment where we figure out, can we get into a 3v3? There's only three people left, so that might take another hour. But that running play style is really tough to get around, especially if you have a bigger weapon, you know, a great hammer, great axe. And I know that because that is a play style that I use. I like running a lot. Sometimes I find running a lot better than rolling in situations, especially to outspace people, because you could get outside their range, just out of their range of their weapon and then come right back. And when you roll, I feel like you can't do that as easy. Like you can't really precisely get to where you want to be. You ain't getting out of this one though. Yeah, there's my uh, my kill of that. You're welcome. Kirby 3 Hey there, Edward, Dunkrick. I already see one Pyromancer. Is that on our team or is that their team? I think that's our team. Oh, come on. I'm trying to help you here, teammate. Help yourself, run away. Oh shit. Oh god, I thought it was gonna actually nab. What was that, dude? I guess that left me some options open to actually kill this fucking guy. You want some? I'm guessing that says dick or something. Alright, I need to bait this guy in. Oh, my teammate got smacked, I think. Did he? I can't tell. I don't know. There's times where you're coming out of the ground and you get smacked. And you just lose HP without being able to help it. Yes, I hit him. Right in the head. Hey there, buddy. Yeah! I used to do like 900, I think. This weapon's pretty solid in 3v3. Not a pun. Is that a range? Oh, I only hit him once, though. Is the guy behind me? What the fuck? You're still going there, Angel! <laughs> God. Okay, let's not get killed by these guys. Run the fuck away. There we are. What does that do? Hmm. 
pretty normal. Got that hyper armor. Oh, I'm gonna die here, I think. Unless I could get that HP back. There we are. Oh shit, I couldn't roll out of that one. Almost a nice assist from my teammate there. It's pretty surprising when the little fireball does 600 damage. You're distracting me with your waves there. Oh, where'd you come from? I told you he was fucking distract. See, you can make friends on the battlefield. Got one of them. Damn it, Kurt Angle. Damn it, I should have done that one. I should have just gone for the right bumper attack. I would have killed him, I think. Can we get the triple kill? Come here, Melly. This is Pele's little brother. Melly. That doesn't make much sense, does it? I knew it. Hit the wrong guy. <laughs> God damn it, I should have just pressed right bumper. I would have been able to trade properly with my hyper armor. Got him! Yeah! I got him, teammate! You move! Throwing knife will do it. Maybe two. Oh! God damn it, he turned right in me. Again, not as gay as it sound that I promise. Oh, good shit, teammate. <laughs> oh no, I almost saved them too. I felt like if I would have staggered him there. Especially since he saved me last time and I'm gonna die here, aren't I? That guy's just getting peppered. Shit, did I die? Am I still alive? That guy's lying down on the floor. And I'm still alive. Pretty surprising outcome. I don't know if I got any kills, though. And I'm pretty sure I'm alive. God damn. Teammates, fireballs do a shit ton of damage, man. I better get greatest combatant up in this bitch. Did I not get a. What happened there? I was in the backstab animation for a while, and he was still in there, too. Oh, match over. Okay. Wait, it's combatant? Double Smohead. This weapon just does some... some real shit with that weapon art. And I mean that in the best way possible. Either way, that is gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any build suggestions or weapon suggestions, feel free to leave them in the comment section down below. Look into my eyes to finish this one. That is my real face. Did you know that? <laughs>